This video will demonstrate running reports in SIX, uh, primarily a proposal report uh, based on a project file. So I'm inside of a project editor right now and over here on the reports tab you have the options of running client reports, installation reports, management reports, and even other reports that you've created. Um, what I'm going to do though is close this and show you another way. Uh, if you're just in the Project Explorer, so the project file is not even open, if you go to the Reports tab, you will have uh, similar options here. So uh, I'm going to choose Client, and I'm going to go run a proposal with images, and I'm going to choose to run this by location. Go ahead and click Run, and this will generate a proposal report for you. And that will open the Report Viewer. And uh, as you can see here, you've got a, a cover page. There is an image here that you can change out prior to running the proposal. Your company information. You can also navigate up here by clicking these buttons or even just typing in a number of the page you want to go to right here. In this case, I'll jump to page three. And what this is showing you here um, is a proposal by location, in this case, the private cinema. Now, a lot of this stuff here is customizable. Uh, meaning you don't have to show the accessories, you don't have to show model numbers if you don't want to, and you certainly don't even have to show individual pricing. Each group will have its own pricing. If I scroll down here, you can see a total here on the private cinema. And then I'll scroll through the rest of the proposal here, and there's the um, final um, numbers here at the end. I'm going to go ahead and scroll back up here and close out of this. Um, oh, before I do that, you can export this to a PDF. You can... Uh, export to rich text, HTML, plain text, and even Excel. Or you can send this directly to Outlook. It will create a PDF copy and open up an Outlook uh, window so you can email yourself the report or the client the report. So uh, some of those options that I mentioned that you can change, um, you change on a uh, definition basis. So this is the report that I just ran. If you right-click and choose Edit Report Definition and go here to the Parameters tab, you can see that I could override, you know, if I'm summarizing accessories uh, based on item setting um, or summarize all of them or none of them. In this case, I'll choose uh, summarize all. And uh, further down, maybe I won't show the item prices. That's the other option we we're talking about. So we'll save this and we'll go ahead and run that again. And this, of course, uh, will open once again the um, report viewer. And in this case, if we scroll down here, you'll see that we're not showing accessories beneath the parts. It looks a little bit cleaner here, and we aren't showing any individual pricing.